We're here at Dr. Black Eye Associates. I'm with Dr. Chris Pugh, and we're talking about light adjustable lens. First of all, what is light adjustable lens and how does it work? Well, th thanks for the opportunity to visit today. We're, we're glad you're here. This practice has been around long, longer than me, 40 years. And one thing that we all love who work here is that this field always changes. There's always something new in, in eye care and eye surgery in particular. So there's always a new lens. But we feel like this is this content's newsworthy because we've never had a lens quite like this. I'm excited to talk to you about it today. Um, it's, it's a lens that can be put in at the time of cataract surgery, and it's in the name. It, there's an adjustability to it, which I'm, I'm excited to get, to, to get into with you today. So how is it different than, say, a traditional lens that you would have implanted during cataract surgery? And we, we've had traditional lenses forever, fancy lenses, new lenses each, each and every year come out, but we've never had a lens that we can put in the eye and then and let the eye heal up and then patients have a chance to just recover like they usually do leave leave the surgery center go get lunch brunch there's there's no new invasive feature to this that the, the, the benefit is that they, they come back in four or five weeks and they have a chance to change their vision and we have a chance to put a lens in the eye and then and then go back and just use uv light and change the way the lens implant in the eye focuses based on, on what you want, what the patient wants. So how does the light adjustment process work after the lens is implanted? And is that painful at all? No, there's, there's no pain. And you, you just put the lens in and like I said, you just go recover and you come back and you can drive to the appointment four or five weeks later and, and you can tell us what you want. And you have three attempts to get the, really to get this right. So now we have an, an implant in the eye and we're just using light energy and UV light to make, to make the vision a little sharper off at a distance or up close. It's in essence like having a pair of glasses that you can just modify and, and, and tweak or enhance on your own up to three times. But this lens is permanent and you, and you keep it forever. What kind of reaction are your patients having to light adjustment lens? What do they think? Yeah, it's, it's fascinating. I mean, there, there's a lot to it. It's, it's, they're, 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 there's more visits and it's, it's for a certain subset of patients, but uh, we really get to know patients. They enjoy it. They enjoy the control they have. Uh, they, they're in the driver's seat. They're test driving different ranges of vision. They go home. We do these over a period of a couple of weeks. Uh, they tell us if they like it. They come back in. They want, they want to see a little bit better up close, a little bit better off at a distance. They're in charge, and, and, and everyone likes that aspect of it. I'm with Randy Pointer. He has had the light adjustable lens procedure, and he's telling us what that process was like. Well, Randy, can you share with us what led you to consider this procedure? Well, I've spent a great deal of my life helping people make decisions as far as what they want to expect after any type of cataract surgery or, or refractive surgery. And um, I found myself in a little bit of a quandary and I really leaned upon uh, Dr. Pugh to get me pointed in the right direction. I knew what I wanted to end up with, but I wasn't really certain what I was gonna choose um, to end up. What was your vision like before the procedure? Well, like a lot of cataract surgery patients, I was in somewhat of denial. I thought my vision was great. Yeah. I was able to function, you know, in my job activities. Computer was pretty good. Driving was good. Um, but that all became very obvious after the surgery, how much it was improved. So yeah, I was in a little bit of denial and just blown away, really, at the quality of my vision that night. Can you tell us what your experience was like with the surgery itself? They have a very, very smooth operation going in our surgery center. The nurses took every opportunity to make me feel comfortable. Everything was explained to me step by step. And anything after the IV was inserted, I have absolutely no recollection, but how there was long, no pain. How long did that procedure last for you? I was in the procedure room for about eight minutes. I was at the facility for probably an hour and 45 minutes. And then take us to kind of the after process. We've heard about the tweaking that, that takes place. How long did it take you to get to where you found your optimal vision? Well, I was really pleased with my vision the very next morning. But when I started contemplating some of the things Dr. Pugh had counseled me on, as far as getting things really dialed in, I felt like my near vision could be a little bit better. My distance vision was perfect. I've always done mono vision, where well, that's where one eye is treated for or set for near and one is set for distance. And I've done that. I've never worn reading glasses. So from the first day that I couldn't see up close, I stuck a contact lens in there. And so with that, Dr. Pugh knew my lifestyle demands without me really even telling him about them. And uh, we've got my distance vision 
day one mm. that was unbelievable. I it was probably annoying people around me by spotting how well I could see things off in a distance, but the up close wasn't right where I wanted it to be. So. What would you say to anybody that's considering it? I would say if you have um, a type A personality and you want to get the best vision that you can possibly get without having to have any concerns about the overall outcome, I'm saying that the light adjustable lens is the way to go because my near vision now is better than I think it was when I was younger and my distance is just perfect. Randy, thank you so much. If you'd like to learn more, just go to have2020.com.